You know, it is. We're $33 trillion in debt. We're having to borrow money just to make our interest payments. China owns some of that debt. But, you know, if you're going to look at that, why don't we look at the fact that why, you know, Republicans put in $7.4 billion of pet projects and earmarks in the budget and Democrats put in $2.8 billion? Why don't we look at all the things we don't need to spend on? It's the reason why I think we need to go back to a budget that starts at zero, says what do we have to have, and then work our way up. It's also why I think we need to put more money in tax taxpayers' pockets. I want to eliminate the federal gas and diesel tax. I want to reduce taxes on middle-class Americans and make our tax structure safer. I want to make the small business tax cuts permanent. They only made them temporary. Let's make them permanent. And, you know, I think a lot of people have vilified the Freedom Caucus in this shutdown conversation. But let's be clear what the Freedom Caucus is really trying to do. They're trying to cut spending. Let's go back and have spending caps so that we make sure that we never overspend. Cut up the credit Credit cards, quit borrowing. 8% of our budget is interest. Let, I will stop the spending. I'll stop the borrowing. We'll eliminate the earmarks. And I will veto any spending bill that doesn't take us back to pre-COVID levels. That's well, how we'll get our country back on track.